Hello, yes, Kensington's problems aren't going away. That's right. Regardless of the Liverpool Echo hatchet job on yours truly, regardless of Joe Anderson telling outright lies and needed help to fill in me election forms the last time I stood uh, for the Liverpool City Council, not a screen in Can Anfield, was that right? 203, 204, something like that. Anyway, you told out and out lies, Joe Anderson. That what you've got to resort to, Mr. Anderson. Where's your evidence? Let's show us your facts and back it up with something uh, concrete. Uh, I needed help to fill in my election forms. Help from who? What a load of baloney. But like I've said, the problems the people of Kensington are now facing are only going to get worse. Yes, Joe Anderson may clear the prostitutes from Shield Road, Bowler Street. He may uh, do a few small concessions. That's what they'll do from now to till May. But the main problems that area faces aren't going away. They're going to get worse. Right? And look at the hysterical response from the Liverpool Echo and Joe Anderson. I'm one person by myself in my back room with my books. And I've got the Liverpool Echo and the might of the Liverpool City Council against me. For what? If I'm this crank, lunatic and joke, what's all the fuss over? Well, I'll tell you what all the fuss is over. The people in Kensington have had enough. I speak to people on the ground there, unlike Joe Anderson. And the area is indeed commonly known as Kenya, whether or not we like it or not, Mr. Anderson. I'm going to campaign hard in Kensington. Kensington Fairfield, is it? The wall's been changed now. It's got a new name, but all the same. All I ask for is to be left alone. Right? I don't bother anyone. I've no intentions of attacking or criticising or getting into any arguments with any other candidates that are standing in the area. And I ask the same to be applied to me. I want to be left alone. Let the residents of Kensington and Fairfield decide. Not the Liverpool Echo. And certainly not Joe Anderson. Okay, thank you.